Hey, how's it going, guys? Is the weather also so bad where you live? I don't know. <laughs> I would actually like to know because right now the weather in Belgium is fucking horrible. Anyway, so now I'm going to try to catch the Pokemon you guys voted for, and that's the Cedar Wooder. Um, well, well, it seems like only Golem got one more vote besides Pseudo Wudo, so, so you guys seem to really like fucking Pseudo Wudo. So far, I've been really lucky in terms of, uh, in terms of having you guys vote for the same Pokemon I vote for. It's actually kind of funny, but hey, I'm gonna try to catch this sucker. I think I have enough Pokeballs. Maybe not, well, I don't know, man. It's a Pseudo Wudo. I mean, it's not a fucking legendary Pokemon or anything like that, so I shouldn't be stressing out that much. Uh, now he goes for Block. I don't even know what that does. Does that, like, disable me to uh, run away or something? I don't know. <laughs> we can keep on going. And there we have it. We have Pseudowoodo. Pseudowoodo's data was added. It's the imitation Pokemon. It mimics a tree to avoid being attacked by enemies. But since its four legs remain green throughout the year, it is easily identified as a fake in the winter. Its four legs are, are green? I don't really see how that can happen, but hey, I'm just gonna call you bald because of the obvious. <laughs> he, he, he has a lot of balls. Nice, shiny, salty chocolate balls. Or maybe not, <laughs> maybe not that shiny and, and salty and stuff. But hey, there's still balls nonetheless. Kids can still play with them. As in a legal way and stuff. Anyway, so he has sturdy the ability, uh, relaxed nature. That's probably not too good. It seems like his physical attack is fairly good. His physical defense, definitely. I mean, that is to be expected of a rock Pokemon. And he knows rock slide, low kick, block, and faint attack. I like it, I like it. I mean, he's definitely a good Pokemon that I might be able to use if if I were to ever get wiped out or something. Although I although I doubt that that will happen, unless unless I have to battle like a Pokemon trainer that has like, a, that, yeah, that has like overpowered electric legendary Pokemon or something, then Kyogre might not be a match for it, and then I might get my ass kicked. But hey, I'm not gonna start panicking, I'm not, not gonna start panicking yet. And how do I get back up there? Uh, I think I'm going in the right direction. Now, which Pokemon should I give some love this episode? It's a, it's a bit of a tricky situation, but perhaps Azula together with Brony. A fancy couple indeed. <laughs> Alright, so this is a double battle. John. John the twosome, John and Jay. John and Gay. Right, I, I think I think that I should probably switch out at least one Pokemon here because I have both a weakness to fire and to electricity. There's no real use uh, staying here, so I might as well switch to Moother. I mean, he, he needs some loving as well. And then we're gonna go for strength against Magmar. Why Magmar? It's because I don't want to get paralyzed, but it seems like it's too late anyway. <laughs> Fuck. All right, I can still keep on going. Thunderbolt. I can I can handle that. There you go. Now let's go, go for his strength, and now, is Moother gonna die or not? I don't know. I mean, he can die. Yes, he died, alright. <laughs> Shit, man, I took a bit of a risk there. Shouldn't have done that, but hey. Nothing, well, there's no, there's nothing that we can do about it. There you go, let the buzz, you're dead. I wasn't really prepared. I wasn't really prepared for, uh, for, uh, for battling those Pokemon, for fuck's sake, man. I just lost my Moother. That's, that's kind of sad. I mean, Moother was not a bad Pokemon, not at all, but, uh, well, on the other hand, he, he wasn't really like my best Pokemon. He, he, he well, I, I basically never use him. That's basically it. I could never use him because of, because of all the time disadvantages and stuff like that, and he doesn't really have that much of a move pool and stuff, so perhaps it's for the better. Perhaps now I might be able to move on in life. And it's actually quite ironic because the next Pokemon type you, well, the next Pokemon type you guys can vote for, or you guys can, you guys can want me to vote for, <laughs> what a failure in the last episode I said that. Anyway, so, so the next Pokemon type happens to be normal as well. And that's actually kind of ironic. Uh, please be sure to vote. I'm gonna whip out the list uh, somewhere in the uh, future, somewhere, somewhere in this episode. Now let's store you in here in hell, Moother. I'm sorry, but you weren't good enough. Now who should I use now? That's a bit of a tricky situation, to be honest. <clears throat> I mean, I'm, I'm currently not using any Dragon Pokemon, but perhaps I should actually, well, perhaps I should whip out Kevin. That would be a pretty cool bet, but then again, I don't have uh, any Steel Pokemon anymore, so maybe I should go for Naito. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I mean, he's level 40 as well and stuff, so I'm gonna be able to use him. I might as well give him some loving right now. There you go. By the way, if you're wondering, Arno, why, why does your voice sound so deep and so masculine? Well, for one, it doesn't. But for two, uh, I just woke up. <laughs> so, so that might explain a lot. Alright, uh, let's go for my iceberg. <clears throat> man. My voice is so is, is so raspy and stuff whenever I wake up. I'm very sorry if it, if it's painful to listen to. Although although well, I I I well, 
I doubt that you guys were actually that, that you guys would actually already noticed this. So yeah. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just overthinking things, shouldn't be too hard on myself, I actually read that in the comments a couple of times, you guys seem to be worried about me, you guys seem to, you guys seem to not want me to take it, to take it out of myself, but when I make pedophile jokes, maybe I should, <laughs> alright, now where the fuck do I need to go, do, do I need to go up here or something, yes, I did, now this is the route onwards to the uh, victory road and to the league and stuff, but I doubt that I have to go here yet, I mean, it could be, but I, I doubt it. Now, I have my Naito up front, what kind of moves does he have? Uh, slash, I'm definitely going to be able to use Slash. For some reason, even non-same non type attack bonus normal moves like Slash, they do a, they, well, they do a lot more damage uh, than stab moves that have like the same base damage. It's pretty darn weird. Uh, I don't really know what to think about that. Now, let's go for Slash. You will see that it actually does a fair amount of damage. Oh shit, Bubble Beam. I'm switching out. I'm switching out of here. I'm done, that's for sure. <laughs> Let's go for Azula. And uh, nope, he did not go for Pursuit, so that means that I'm not dead. There you go. Silver Wind up your ass. These Pokemon are actually getting better and better. Fuck. But it seems like these Pokemon trainers have Pokemon that are somewhat like the same level as mine, so perhaps I am going in the right direction. I mean, otherwise, otherwise they would have probably been overleveled. And I still have two gym badges to go or some shit like that. It's kind of weird. Like, how many badges do I have? Yeah, six, that's it. I mean, there should be eight, right? Now, this is the Pokemon League, and I need Waterfall to go up it. Well, fuck that, that, that sucks. Right, now maybe if I go to the left, there is something that I can do. Nope, that was it. So, so much for my uh, League adventure, then I pretty much have no clue where to go. I mean, I, I think that I need uh, Rock Climb to get to uh, this town here. But maybe if I go, maybe if I start from Mystic Town, perhaps then I might be able to reach it. I don't know, I'm kind of lost here. <laughs> I'm, I'm lost quite often. That will obviously not happen in my uh, in my upcoming Let's Plays, because it's going to be like uh, real Pokemon Let's Plays and stuff. So yeah, now let's go to the left and take a look where I need to go. Wasn't there like, wasn't there like a tree that I could cut or some shit like that? Yes. Although I think I have already cut down this tree. I could be mistaken though. Let's take a look. Can I go left here somewhere? Nope, so I'm gonna have to cut down that tree. Uh, which Pokemon of mine has cut? None of them do. And I'm not gonna use an HM slave uh, that's supposed to be dead. I'm, I'm obviously I'm not gonna do that. So perhaps I should teach Air Cutter to a Pokemon of mine. Uh, Naito can actually learn it. I mean, he doesn't really have that much of a varied moveset, so I might as well get rid of Iron Defense. There you go. I mean, it's not a bad move. It's not as bad as the actual cut TM. So I'm, I'm, I'm glad. I'm, I'm really glad that they changed it up and stuff, and that it's now a flying move. It makes more sense if you ask me, because flying is super effective against grass, and these trees are obviously closer to the grass Pokemon type than anything else. So it makes sense that it's super effective against these trees. And maybe again, I'm overthinking things. All right, now let's go onwards. Yes, it seems like I haven't gone here yet. Well, I should have probably. Like, what the hell, man? I'm perhaps perhaps I should perhaps I should have gone here like way before, <laughs> from the second that I got the TM or HM rather. Damn. Or actually, no. I mean, they're they're like they're like 32 level Pokemon here. That's kind of bad, but it, 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 it it's it's not as bad as I thought it would be, as it's, uh, as I thought it was going to be, or it would be. Ah, <clears throat> oh, man. My English is bad whenever I wake up. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> All right, now let's take a look. It's a Moody. All these cute little Pokemon. Not much of a challenge if you ask me. Ah, oh, it's a cute little Sneasel you have there. Actually, Sneasel would be a Pokemon I would love to play with at some point in my future Let's Plays because I've never played with an Ice Pokemon like Sneasel before. All of my Ice Pokemon have, uh, well, all of my Ice Pokemon have been like Ice Water Pokemon, like Lapras. And I would kind of, I would kind of want to like try it out. I don't know, but but perhaps in one of my future let's plays or something. Now let's go for Metal Claw. As you as you will be able to see, Metal Claw will probably do less damage than Slash. Well, it's, it's sort of like the same, but it shouldn't be the same because I have Stab. Is something like fucked up or something? I don't know, man. He wants to learn Swords Dance. Ah, this is this is tricky. Uh, there there's this one guy who commented on a, who commented on one of my previous videos that I should really keep Swords Dance on one of my Pokemon. It was on Brody, and I decided not to. Uh, so I'm, I'm also not going to teach it now, because Brody's still alive. I mean, there's nothing happening. Oh shit, he goes for a dig. Uh, we're going to switch out to a flying Pokemon then, because obviously I don't want to have to take that dig to the face. There you go. Now I think it's time to go for, for Fox Sheik, man. For Fox to Sheik. Are you for fucking real? <laughs> that accent, though. All right. 
Duck Trio, you're dead. Fortunately, you're a ground Pokemon, so you are already closer to hell than all the other Pokemon. You, you, you don't have to go that, uh, that, that long of a way. All right, now let's go for a uh, Feint Attack. That's going to be super effective. Doesn't do that much damage, though. And if he, if, he, if he pulls off some weird move, like, I don't know, Mirror Code or something, and it actually hits, then I'm going to be very mad. Because <laughs> I don't want to lose too many Pokemon in this episode. Alright, seems like I have hit a cave. Hopefully it's not going to be a dark cave, because I swear to God, I'm, 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 I'm going to punch some seals when I end this episode. If, if this is a cave where I'm going to need Flash for. Uh, let's use some Super Potions on Nightall and on Azura. There you go. We can keep our lightning bending. Alright. A Graveler. Uh, we don't really want to mess with Graveler as, uh, well, with this Pokemon. Or maybe we do. Maybe Metal Claw. Actually, yes, it does a lot of damage. There you go. Now we've got a Nose Pass. I doubt that these guys are going to have Earthquake. Uh, if they do, then I might take a huge hit from that. But it seems like that's not going to happen. There you go. Metal Claw and shit. <laughs> Man, Knight, though, you're, you're, you're definitely proving uh, your worth, that's for sure. Yeah, let's, let, let's keep on going. Uh, is this a way down? Oh, it's a cave! Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yes, Arno, this is a cave! This has to be my number one failure! Oh, it's a cave! It's a bridge. <laughs> Sorry, the bridge have to repair. Come back later. <coughs> the grammatical error aside, I don't want to have to come back later, but hey. I mean, I... I, I well, I, I, I guess that I could just go all 300 style and stuff and just push you off, but I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not a bad person. I'm not gonna do that. And uh, now we're gonna Luxray. Uh, I think I'm just gonna switch out to my Brony. Perhaps go for a, uh, perhaps go for like a, uh, a strength or something. If I don't hurt myself in my confusion, which I don't, and you're dead, Julio. You're dead. All right, now let's keep on going. Uh, perhaps I should actually enter this cave. This better not be a dark cave. No, it's not. This is, these are the meteor falls, but it seems like I can't go here. So that, well, so, so much for my fucking adventure. Yay. Um, well, there are some other places that I could go to, I guess. Uh, if I go, if I use the move fly, and if I go back to the town where I could, where I could take the boat, crap, oh. Uh, if, if you're wondering where I want to go, I'm gonna go back to the, uh, uh, what's it called again? Battle Island, Battle Frontier thing with with all the challenges and stuff. Um, I'm 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 gonna try to go past those two guys who were there and who were blocking the way. Maybe they're gone now. I don't know. Or maybe maybe uh, since I got something, I think. Did I get a key item? Like uh, a chocolate bar or whatever it was from 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 uh, Pulio City. No, I didn't. So I'm actually gonna go back there because apparently you can get a chocolate bar or some shit. And there's this guy in this town, Ossipek town, who really wants it. And if I can give it to him, maybe he'll give me something as well. Let's take a look. This, this guy's the move tutor, fuck you up your ass. I don't need a fucking move tutor. Only I can tutor things to my Pokemon. Like all moves in bed. All right, now let's take a look. Uh, you're just an old Gramps. I don't need you in my life. Perhaps it's this house then. Yes, this is, uh, this seems like an important guy. Oh, that's so hard to develop my tool, and finally, is there anyone to have it? Oh, good, if you bring me bully at tea, I'll give it to you. Oh, you don't have the tea. Alright, so, I'm, apparently I'm gonna get something if I get him the bully at tea. So, maybe I missed out on something. Maybe I need to go back to Pulia City. Where is it? Where is it? There he is, alright. Did I say Pulio City in the, in, in the beginning? Fuck, <laughs> what a failure. Alright, so we're gonna have to do a little bit of exploring again. This guy's talking about trading, this guy's talking about berries, gives me a berry, thank you very much. This girl <coughs> says, you know, this girl says something about, I don't know, Trainer Hill. I don't need to go there. Um, <laughs> I went there one time, I tried to take the bike challenge, and they fucking, I don't know, they, 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 well, they seem to have abducted me or some shit like that. <coughs> and brought me all the way back to where, well, to where I didn't want to go. You seem to be rather rude. Uh, this is the woman that gave me fly. Thank you very much for that, by the way. It's saving me a lot of time, you woman. Can I get the tea somewhere here? Welcome, how may I serve you? Uh, you don't have tea. Perhaps, perhaps you do. Do you want fast food or a drink? Nope. Nope. For fuck's sake! Just, just, just let me go onwards in my journey. Oh, what's this? I heard something about tea. This tea was passed down through many generations. My grandma used to grow them in the Artisan Hill. Artisan Hill. I don't know where that is. 
Where the fuck is the hill? Who are you? I simply love it here. The atmosphere is so uplifting. Do you, do you want to know what I love? Fucking you right in your pussy. You kept to get emotionally healed too, didn't you? Uh, wait. <laughs> Am I in need of, an, of emotional healing? I mean, it could be, but I, I doubt it. Alright, now let's take a look. Am I gonna get the tea in here somewhere? Yes! Yes! I get the tea! Puhia tea, that's amazing. Alright, now let's uh, finally go back to OC Pack City. I'm solving mysteries. I'm being all Sherlock Holmes in this bitch. Alright, now let's go back to this town and give it to this, uh, to the gentleman. Don't really know whether he's a gentleman or not. It, it basically depends on what he's gonna give me as a reward. Yes! That's cool, yeah, tea. Yeah, I, I handed over. Wait, wait, is my name Sky? Sky handed over the tea. My name is not Sky. My mother is not a hippo, alright? <laughs> Game, is this karma striking back? As I promise, here's my invention the scope. If there's something if, if there's something that you can't see, you should try it. Who might remember something about that? Wasn't there like a gym somewhere? I think it might actually be in this town, the Mystic Town. In which there was a gym, but I could, but I couldn't get there because of something invisible or some shit like that. Or I could be mistaken. Maybe it wasn't this town, but it was, sure, sure was a town. Where was it though? Uh, I'm gonna have to check every single town then. Fuck that shit. But well, we're gonna have to do it. Uh, Pule City. I, I have already done this gym. Forest entrance. Don't need to fly here. Small town. There's no gym here. Plate Pick City. I've already done that gym there. Torozoro City. May, may, Maybe this is the town, I don't know. Let's take a look. This most certainly is not. Nope. I remember some casualties from the, from the last uh, episodes. In this gym, obviously. Uh, how about this town? Perhaps here? I mean, I don't really remember too many- uh, I don't really remember too much from- 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 well, from these two towns. How about this and, uh, Sea Round City or something. So perhaps it's here. I don't know. Let's take a look. Take a good, fresh look. Uh, these guys are selling some shit. How may I save you? No, I don't want dolls. I'm not a girl. I, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm the personification of manliness. Or so I like to think. Alright, so this guy's uh, talking about cushions, secret power, fuck you right up your pussy. I don't need all this shit, man. I really don't. I have had enough of your shit. Alright, perhaps I need to go onwards like this. Perhaps the gym is somewhere here. No, there's no, he's not. Alright. He is not. The gym, he is not here. That's exactly what I said. You guys heard that correctly. Charpo's Island, I think that I have already done this gym as well. If there is a gym here, I don't really know. Wait, what's this? The Pokemon Fan Club, calling calling fans of Pokemon, or whatever that is. Have, haven't I already been here? Yeah. Yeah, I have, I have. <laughs> I didn't really get anything here in the last episode. Uh, oh shit, I should, I should actually whip out the list of the normal Pokemon. Sorry, guys. All right, wonderful people. Here is the list. Uh, you guys can you guys can maybe read it, maybe not, but I'll still read it out loud. It's quite a long list of all the normal Pokemon you guys can vote for. Ironically enough, I lost my normal Pokemon in earlier in this episode. We have Starly, Staravia, Staraptor, Patrat, Watchog. Uh, why why did why did I write Watchdog? Probably the autocorrective word or some shit like that. Uh, Pit of Tranquil and Pheasant, Smeargle, Miltank, Blissey, Clefairy, uh, Clefable, Lilypup, Herdier, Stoutland, uh, Rufflet, Braviary, Zigzagoon, Linood, Chinchino, Minchino, Spinda, Togepi, Togetic, Togekiss, uh, let's scroll down, Skitty, Delcatty, uh, Kecleon, Lickitung, Chansey, Azuril, Spoink, Ditto, Eevee, Porygon, Porygon Z, Porygon 2, Arceus, Snorlax, Slackoth, Vigoroth, Slacking, Zangoose, Castform, Sentret, Furret, Hoot Hoot, Noctowl, Cleffa, Back Up, <laughs> uh, Munchlax, Snorlax, Slackoth, Vigoroth, Slacking, Zangoose, Castform, Sentret, Furret, Hoot Hoot, Noctowl, Cleffa, Buffalant, Dunsparce, Snubble, Gramble, Sawsbuck, Deerling, and Swablu. Wow, lots of Pokemon to choose from. Uh, I wouldn't really say that. I wouldn't really say that there are still a lot of good Pokémon left, to be honest. Is Snorlax in the list? Yes, he is, but he, he might be kind of overused. Perhaps I should go for like Buffalond or some shit like that. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna vote for Buffalond. He seems like a pretty cool male form of uh, Miltank. So I don't know, I'm gonna vote for him. Be sure to vote for one of these Pokémon if you really want to. And uh, well, see you guys in the next episode. But first, I'm gonna first I'm gonna finish off this episode because I want to find the gym where I need to be going.
And now, by all means, let's continue. I still have no virtual clue where I need to go. Uh, <laughs> this fucking sucks, man. I, 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 oh, man, I'm gonna have to search all these fucking towns. This is gonna take a long-ass time, but hopefully I'm gonna find it in this episode, otherwise, otherwise, the, yeah, the entire end of this episode will have been a waste. Uh... All right. So, what other times? What are, what other town towns can we go to? Rather, uh, let's go to Sea Rank City. Perhaps I haven't. Uh, I have. I have. This was the ice gym. Kind of an easy gym, if you ask me. Uh, Peel City. Perhaps it was Peel City after all. Let's take a look. Uh, where is the gym at? Where are you at, you motherfucker? There it is. All right. Uh, no, this is probably a gym I have already gone to. Yes, indeed, I have. I mean, other otherwise, otherwise, these trainers would like try to kill me or some shit like that. So no, it's not this. Then where do I need to go? I really have no clue, man. I'm just gonna search all the towns. Perhaps in small town. Perhaps in my perhaps in my own starter town there is a gym. I doubt it though. No, there is not. Then we have some other towns left, I think. Oh, to see the city had a gym. Bullia yeah, City did not have a gym. Charpos Island did not have a gym. OC Pack Town did not have a gym either. Pule City, nope. Mystic Town, nope. Or maybe it is Mystic Town. I mean it should be, if I remember correctly. This, this, this is where I need to go. Perhaps I'm just missing out on something really obvious here. Probably not though, but hey, <laughs> Mystic Town, a mystic and a rainy land. What a way of promoting your own fucking town, man. Already, already giving away that it's fucking rainy. All right, then what's this? This brings me back here. Nope, I don't need to go here. Well, you know what? I might as well end this episode. I mean, well. There is no use walking around mindlessly and stuff and not finding anything. So you know what, guys? I'm going to end this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I did. Sorry sorry that I had just woken up and stuff. Perhaps I should make these episodes like at a different time of the day. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. Completely homo. <laughs> no, just kidding. See ya.